Lamech, Hebrew, Lemek Lemech was a patriarch in the genealogies of Adam in the book of Genesis. According to Christianity, he is part of the genealogy of Jesus in Luke chapter 3 verse 36. Additionally, Lamech Arabic, L -A -M -K, is also mentioned in Islam in the various collections of tales of the pre-Islamic prophets, which mentions him in an identical manner. Topic: <laughs> Bible narrative 28 And Lamech lived a hundred eighty and two years, and begat a son. 29 And he called his name Noah, saying, This same shall comfort us concerning our work and toil of our hands, because of the ground which the Lord hath cursed. 30 And Lamech lived after he begat Noah five hundred ninety and five years, and begat sons and daughters. 31 And all the days of Lamech were seven hundred seventy and seven years, and he died. Genesis chapter 5 verses 28 to 31 KJV Topic Family Lamech is the 8th generation descendant of Adam Genesis chapter 5 verse 25 the son of Methuselah and the father of Noah Genesis chapter 5 verse 29 in the genealogy of Seth in Genesis chapter 5 in Genesis chapter 5 verses 12 to 25, Lamech was a son of Methuselah, who was a grandson of Jared, who was a grandson of Kenan descended from Adam. Genesis chapter 5 verses 28 to 31 records that Lamech was 182 years old at the birth of Noah and lived for another 595 years, attaining an age at death of 777 years, five years before the flood in the Masoretic chronology. With such numbers in this genealogical account, Adam would still have been alive for about the first 56 years of Lamech's life. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Prophetic naming. When Lamech named his son Noah, he prophesied, "This same shall comfort us concerning our work and toil of our hands, because of the ground which the Lord hath cursed." Genesis chapter 5 verse 29 The people were cumbered with the toil of cultivating a ground that had been cursed in Genesis chapter 3 verse 17, and they hoped for relief through Noah. Albert Barnes noted, In stating the reason of the name, they employ a word which is connected with it only by a second remove. Nu Nuach and Am Nachem are stems not immediately connected, but they both point back to a common root nh nch signifying to sigh, to breathe, to rest, to lie down. At Noah's sacrifice in the new world after the flood, the Lord said, I will not again curse the ground any more for man's sake, for the imagination of man's heart is evil from his youth, neither will I again smite any more everything living, as I have done. References <references>